49. 50! Ready or not, here I come! I'm sorry he won't play with you. But right now, we have to be very quiet. Shh! Oh! How did you find me? Gotcha! Aww! <laughs> that almost worked, fellas. <laughs> Congratulations! Now help me up. I don't know about you girls, but my belly's growling. Yeah, it's getting late. We're never gonna find Tank. Alright, let's go eat. I win! <gasps> so, what's for dinner? to see everyone bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. <laughs> Welcome to my new class. Flowers, not just for garden fairies. Today, we're gonna learn how to grow a fairy gold. A special flower created right here in Pixie Hollow through a painstaking process of careful cultivation. <laughs> Then, it all begins with the seed. Uh, you till the soil, plant the seed, give it a little shade, water it, and fertilize. Okay, class, let's get those seeds in the ground. We've only got one fairy gold seed left, so let's make this one count. Hit it, Tank! from your friends. Hi, everyone. Look what we made. <laughs> Class dismissed. How do I train for the Pixie Hollow games? Hard! Get out of the way. I show no mercy. <laughs> Okay, maybe a little mercy. I mean, like medium mercy, but just not tons of mercy, you know, only. How do I train for the Pixie Hollow games? than the speed of sound. That's how I train. OK, 
Okay, guys, it's easy. Just stay on your frog for eight seconds and you're my partner in the Pixie Hollow games. Who's first? Ready. Whoa. Next. Oh, no, no. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. Did I do it? Buck. Huh? Hold on tight. Huh? Hey, my foot is stuck. Whoa! Since the dawn of time, fairies from all over have gathered to compete in the Pixie Hollow Games. Enter, but only one will win. Let the games begin! Uh, guys? The games aren't today! What? But they are coming soon! Coming soon! Lydia, do you really need to practice for the Pixie Hollow games right here? Oh, come on, Tink. I'm in it to win it. Tag, you're it on. Lydia! <gasps> Tag, you'll have to catch me first! <laughs> <laughs> Your turn, Skeeter. Come on, Skeeter. You can do it. Silver Mist! Silver Mist! 
Have you seen Tinkerbell? Why, no. Have you guys seen Tinkerbell today? <laughs> Where could she be? round wasn't half bad, but I think we can do way better if we dig way down deep. <laughs> Ready? Fun! Have you seen Tinkerbell? Sorry, Ro, I haven't seen her. I've been here practicing with the frogs all morning. Lizzie! <gasps> you have been practicing. Elizabeth! Time for lunch, darling. Humans? <gasps> Where's Tinkerbell? Attaboy, Cheese. Almost there. <laughs> Hi, Vidya. Look what I found. Isn't it cute? Ooh, a little toy man. Interesting. I'll say. I found it over by the human house. Perhaps you haven't heard. Humans are dangerous. Ugh. Oh, Vidya, humans may be, but how dangerous could this cute little man thingy be? Uh-oh. Uh, cheese! Get off of me! Oh. <laughs> No, 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 look, 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 look. All I'm saying is, none shall pass might not be ominous enough, right? Let's try and um, pass at your own peril. <laughs> that's, your, that's not ominous, that's a helpful suggestion. No, 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 it isn't. It implies consequences if you pass. Perilous consequences. No, it does. Oh, dear. <laughs> a balloon! None shall pass. pass at your own peril! What did you say? Hey, guys, play nice. 
Well, apparently ominous warnings don't work on balloons. You went with peril. Excuse me? You went with peril with this Yes, because it's peril. into my rainbow. Rainbow? Uh... Mm -hmm. Whoa, whoa, slow down, Cheese. What's this about Tinkerbell? Tinkerbell is wishing? She's fishing? Kissing? Tinkerbell is missing! <gasps> Tink is missing? Nobody tells me anything! Oh, there's one, my dear. Wow, she was bright. It's quite bright, actually. Look, there goes another. She's a fast fairy, that one. <laughs> what? what? Fairy? Did you say fairy? Why, of course, Father. They jump off the clouds, you see, and fly ever so fast through the night sky. I can just see them now. They're laughing and taking turns diving off. One says, my turn. My turn. And she takes a running leap and dives. <laughs> they all clap in approval. Oh, Lizzie. A shooting star is merely a bit of rock, not fairies. Oh, no, Father. That's silly. They are fairies, all right. And they're here all around us right now. Hundreds of them. And maybe more. My, my. You do have quite the imagination, my dear. And I hope you never lose it. jar of pixie dust is secure. If anything were... Relax, Iridessa. We've got a smooth road and your moonbeam to light the way. Sure, but Terrence was very clear This that... pixie dust carrier is the pinnacle of my tinkering. It'll keep the dust locked up good and tight. This dust isn't going anywhere except where we take it. Get the net. Again. Listen up, jumpsters. Coach Vaughn here to whip you into shape for the Pixie Hollow Games. We need a few good frogs, and you're the best of the best. We chose you because you care about one thing and one thing only. Winning! And we don't 
want a repeat of last year's stink bug incident? So I'm counting on you to be mature. More than any other frogs in Pixie Hollow, you all have discipline. Discipline. I think I've made my point. Are we clear? Ugh. Addies, men. Addies. Tinkerbell, these fall colors for the leaves are just wonderful. Yeah, nice and bright, too. Uh, where's the red? Oh, she's right. Can't have fall without red, after all. Okay. Oh, I must say, that is absolutely breathtaking. But it's not what I'm looking for. Oh. Maybe if you added some blue. Good idea. Is that even a color? Hmm. I got it! Ladybug with a hint of squirrel. I'm partial to watercolor. Oh, 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 and a bit of rose and cherry blossom. But make it red. That's it! That's the red I'm looking for! <laughs> <laughs> Honeycomb cakes, get your fresh honeycomb cakes here. Honeycomb man. <laughs> honeycomb cakes here. On my way. Let's go. Honeycomb cakes, my favorite. Tank, tank, there's honeycomb cakes. Hurry up, we're gonna miss it. Oh. <laughs> There you are. You missed the cake. Good thing I grabbed one for you. I got you one. So did I. Me too. Howdy, Rosetta. Guess who's got a cool breeze for you? Well, thank you, darling. Hey, Silver Mist. Looking cool. Thanks, best friend. Hey, Vidya. Want to come to the cove with us? You know it, Tink. Let me carry the umbrella, please. Great. We'll see you in a little bit. Yay! This is going to be flitterific! <gasps> <gasps> Whoa. What a horrible nightmare. Hey, Vidya. Want to come to the cove with us? The cove? Um, okay. But you carry the umbrella. This is going to be flitterific. Notice, Bubble. Nothing up my sleeves. Amazing! Is this your card? It is, Clanky! It is! <laughs> and now, I will pull a bunny out of the basket of mystery. Ooh. Ah! Oh! <gasps> ah! Fantastic! Oh! A bunny and a crow oh! costume! After all the work we did today, making our own hot springs was the perfect idea. Thanks for bringing the heat, Iridessa. Very sweet, Rosetta. Nice touch, Vidya. Now, before we dive in, may I suggest some cool sunflower tea? That's my favorite! This is gonna be so relaxing. Look at this amazing skunk bath I found! You know, we should make something like this for ourselves. So what is it, Tank? It's a wing washer. Think of it. No more having to scrub each other's wings. Watch! That thing looks dangerous! Iridessa! <laughs> That was wonderful! Look how the light catches my wings! They're beautiful! Well, back to the drawing board. Uh, yeah.
settle down. Okay, now that we've covered the do's and the don'ts, who wants to go first? No one? Great! You ready, little guy? <laughs> Here we go! I've got it! <laughs> My turn! Uh-oh. Who wants to go next? <laughs> I don't know, Blaze. I think we're lost. Maybe we should pull over and ask for directions. Fine, scaredy cat. I'll do it. How about these guys? Excuse me. Hi. Do you know the way out of this forest? Well, thanks anyways. Come on, please. Uh, pardon me, but can you tell us the way out of the forest? Ooh. What? No, you. Ooh. Oh, never mind. Uh, good evening, ma'am. We're lost, and we're wondering if you could tell us how to get out of this forest? Oh, great. I see. We go straight through these trees, make a left at the rock, and then an immediate right at the stream. Okay, yes, that makes sense. Come on, Blaze, let's go. Thanks again, Miss Spider. Yes, yes, Blaze, you're right. We should have just checked the web in the first place. How to ice skate. Ice skating, in which the participant balances on the narrowest of blades. When done by an expert, it looks effortless. <laughs> But it isn't. The winter fairies make it look so easy. Are you all right, my dear? Oh, Fairy Mary, are you joining us? Oh, I thought I might take a spin. Just be careful. Ice skating is hard. Oh, don't I know it. Indeed, the beginner oh. should start with the most basic, utterly simple move. Oh. <clears throat> I said the most basic. Uh, crossover step if you're feeling brave, but nothing more. <clears throat> oh. Okay, so maybe this isn't your first spin on the ice. Even so, the intermediate should never attempt a uh, quadruple axle, a uh, toe loop, a cell cow. I don't even know what that's called. In all my years, a flying starfish haircut or death spiral combination. Impossible. <clears throat> and, uh, that is how you ice skate. Fairy Mary! That was amazing! Oh, that was just me warm up. <gasps> how to ride a toboggan. On a winter's day, there are few things more pleasant than a nice, gentle toboggan ride with friends. Thanks, Winter Fairies, for inviting us to ride one of your, uh, thingies. Have fun! Of course, the novice tobogganer should stick with more moderate, gentle slopes at first. <gasps> too steep! Way too steep! Um, guys? What? What is it? As you calmly coast, <gasps> simply relax and enjoy the ride. We're doomed! When riding a toboggan, it is important to always face forward. And for your own safety, you must remain seated at all times. <laughs> To stop your toboggan, simply apply pressure by placing your feet gently to the ground. And thus, you might pause to take in the beautiful winter scenery. <laughs> Toboggans are not designed for extreme winter sporting. But for the rider who takes it nice and slow, tobogganing is sure to bring nothing but smiles. Congratulations! You've safely completed your maiden voyage. Huh? We made it down? Made it down? <laughs> You're only halfway. Halfway? <laughs> Have fun! See you at the bottom! How to build a snowman. 
Since snow first fell to the earth, he's been a beloved seasonal icon. Yes, it's that jolliest of winter fellows, the ever-cheerful snowman. I'm starting to think I'm not very good at this. Oh, chin up, Clanky. Just watch the winter fairies. Yeah, try again, and this time, throw yourself into it. You're right. I think I'll give it another go. To construct your snowman's base sphere, gather a small handful of snow and, ever so carefully, begin to roll it on the ground. As it rolls, your snowball will slowly increase in diameter. This is my first time, so not too fast. <laughs> Next, proceed to form a second, smaller sphere, or your snowman's torso. Come on, Slowpokes! Uh, wait! Uh, hey! I think I got it! Me too! <laughs> You've now graduated to your final sphere, or the head, as it were, which should bear a pleasant expression to reflect the snowman's sunny disposition. Run for your lives! With your three spheres completed, gently stack one atop another in descending size order. And just like that, your snowman is complete. Well done, Clanky! But how? I... Did like you said, I just threw myself into it. <laughs> How to have a snowball fight? Oh, a snowflake. So beautiful. <gasps> Ouch. Congratulations. You've just been invited to your first snowball fight. Aww, the winter fairies want to play. <laughs> to accept, softly toss a snowball back in reply. And thus, a gentle volley ensues. Take cover! The snowball fight is a loosely organized, informal affair. Taking on winter fairies in a snowball fight? What were we thinking? I've got a plan. Cover me. I'm on it. Fun! Go on without me! Good, clean, wholesome fun is the name of this game. The smell of snowballs in the morning. We're never gonna make it! Just make it stop! If all seems lost, remember, there's no shame in surrender. You might even invite your opponent for a nice cup of hot cocoa. Too much? Snowball fight ever! <laughs> Best two out of three. Mmm, mmm. The only thing more delicious than honeysuckle tea is this beautiful day at Peg Leg Point. Hey, does anyone know why they call this place Peg Leg Point? Arg. Arg? Arg. You know, pirates. Arg. Ooh! <laughs> Arg! Arg? Arg! 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 I don't do pirate. Hey guys, look what I found on the beach! Arg! 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 Not doing it! Arg! 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 Trust me, Vidya, you will not regret looking for lost things with me. Oh, yes. That's exactly why I wanted to come to the beach. Totally. <gasps> Pirate treasure! No way! I wonder if there's more. Uh, hey, Vidya, help me look! Sure thing, Tink. I'll get right on it. Oh, wow! A uh, holler if you find anything!
Pirate treasure is not gonna hurt ya. You don't know that tank! Ah! 